Yo, what's up guys, home, welcome back to a brand new video here on my channel. And in today's video, I'm gonna show you how to actually get lower ping in Fortnite Chapter 2 Season 7 with a few simple steps. Trust me guys, everything I'm going to show you here, I actually utilize myself personally to get zero ping in creative and only like 10 ping in normal games, which is actually insane. And if you guys want to support my work, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel. This would help me out so, so much. And please also consider to maybe join my Discord. We are over 10,000 active members. And if you have any questions about, I don't know, stretch resolution, how to boost FPS and stuff like that, you already know where to ask. And with that said, let's get straight into this topic. Sure. And what I want to talk about in the first place is actually quite simple. You all know, guys, that you have like a LAN adapter built into your PC. It doesn't matter if you utilize Wi-Fi or just like a straight up Ethernet connection. You're probably going to have a real tech network adapter because that's like the most common one and actually most PCs have that one and if you guys didn't know Windows actually doesn't have all the access to get always like the latest version so therefore yours might be actually outdated from a few years ago and I'm just gonna show you in a quick tutorial how to make sure that you're running the latest version and yeah guys what I would like you to do in the first place is go on the official Ritech website link is by the way gonna be in the description and what we're gonna get here is the gaming Ethernet family controller and what this software does is truly amazing it actually automatically optimizes our Ethernet controller for gaming so we have like the lowest latency possible and what you guys just need to do is scroll down here until you find this huge list where you can get auto installation for Windows 11, Windows 10, Windows 8, Windows 7. It really depends on which operating system you use and as you can see I just lately upgraded here actually to Windows 11 so I need to get the one here for Windows 11 obviously. If you're on Windows 10 just get this one and just simply click on it and download it. And once you downloaded the right file guys just simply um, put it onto your desktop and you can already see that I already unpacked it here. So I'm just simply gonna double click onto it and we're gonna go through the whole entire installation process here. And yeah, you can already see the uh, installation is getting prepared. And this is how it looks like. We're just gonna go here onto next and install and just gonna simply install the latest version which is gonna be optimal for our PC. And you can already see it guys, the newest driver version is getting installed 11.24 and we're just gonna wait until this whole process here is done. It shouldn't take um, like too long. So guys, and you can already see it's done here, installation shield wizard completed. We're just gonna press here on finish and now go into a Windows search bar and type in device until we find the device manager and just simply open it up here guys. And then we're gonna scroll down here a little bit until we find network adapters and then we can already see it, Realtek Gaming GB family controller. You can already see it's installed properly now. And yeah guys, just to check real quick that we actually installed the right version guys, we're gonna go here onto properties and click onto drivers and you can already see it under the driver date that we got the latest version here from July 14th, 2021. And yeah, everything is installed properly. And if it somehow doesn't showcase the right version, guys, just simply right click onto it and go into update drivers, browse my computer for drivers, let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer. And there you can see right now here the latest version, Realtek Gaming GB Family Controller Realtek. Just simply go in it and go onto next and then just install it manually here. And you should also have it enabled properly. And with that said, we're already done here with this first step, guys. And yeah, guys, for this next step, we're gonna take a look here at this small boost pack here, which I just made, which is called Disable Network Services. And we're just gonna open it up it's gonna be on my discord guys the link is gonna be in the description just feel free to join there over 10,000 active members as mentioned so if you have any issues feel free to ask all the people there and they can also get this file here and as you can see we got apps disabled we have disabled Xbox services and disabled download maps and pretty much here on apps we have like some of the really most unnecessarily Windows services which you can just straight up disenable and yeah we just gonna like double click onto it and run it as an administrator and the rec editor is gonna make it automatically already um, adding information can intentionally change or delete values but we're just gonna click here on yes because everything is safe guys I use this all myself then next up disable Xbox services I think everyone knows that Microsoft has like this new Xbox thing here built into Windows 10 and 11 where you can screen share your gameplay and stuff like that but we don't just simply need that and it's running always 24 7 in the background costing us important network latency so therefore yeah just simply like click on it and then here on disable download maps I don't know if you know it but um, like usually here on um, Windows you have like a feature which is called maps uh, where you have like literally like built in Google Maps which you just don't utilize and it's always running 24 7 in the background also stressing out your network connection and costing you important performance while playing so we're just simply gonna go on it as well here disable download maps we're just gonna go into it click yes here again press yes Yes, and yeah, we successfully applied all of these here correctly guys. As mentioned, this small pack is gonna be on my Discord, so yeah, the link is gonna be in the description. And with that said, we're already done here. And yeah guys, this is it for today's video. If you enjoyed it, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel. This would help me out so, so much. And if you still have any more questions, feel free to ask them down in the comment section below. I try to answer as many as possible. And with that said, have a great day, have a great night whenever you're watching this. And until next time, stay awesome, I'm out. Peace. That's it too late. Big four, oh, come get inside. Diamond Gucci.